Where has my tender gone? Has someone seen my tender? Oh no, where's my tender? Where's my tender? Where's my tender? Has anyone seen my tender? Hi James, I wouldn't stay still for too long if I were you. Wizard Funling told me there's a tender ghost about taking tenders. A tender ghost? Don't be silly Thomas, there's no such thing. Really? So, where has your tender gone James? Ah, oh no, it must have been the tender ghost. There it is Thomas, up ahead. I'll get it back. Huh? Percy? Where did the tender go? What tender? I didn't see a tender. That's strange. I'm sorry James, Wizard Funling was right. It looks like the tender ghost has your tender now. Boo! Wah! No <laughs> golden! You're such a scaredy cat, Wizard Funling. I'm not a scaredy cat. Why does everyone keep calling me that? Gordon, don't stay still for too long, as there's a tender ghost, and it'll take your tender. Tender ghost? Don't be silly, Thomas. Oh no, it looks like we're too late. What? Oh, where's my tender gone? There it is. I'll get it back. Huh? It's gone again. Oh, this is really spooky. There you are, Detective Funling. We need your help. A tender ghost is taking all of the tenders. A tender ghost? Hmm, that sounds serious. So something is taking the tenders without being seen. I'll help! And then disappearing with them around corners. I'll help! Sounds impossible to be honest. Oh help! You won't be much help Wizard Funling. You're a scaredy cat. I am not a scaredy cat. Why does everyone say that? In order to believe it, I need to see a tender disappear with my own eyes. Well, I think you're in luck. Emily's tender has just gone missing. And there it is, up ahead. I'll get it back. What? They've completely disappeared again. Sorry Thomas, I've never seen that happen before. And I can only think that it's a ghost. I'm leaving before the ghost gets me, so uh, bye. Later that day, Thomas was telling some of the other engines with tenders all about the tender ghost. Ooh. I'm never leaving this tunnel. Me too. Me too. Well, I have to leave soon. I'm needed back on the mainland. I'll come with you, Merlin. I would like one more chance at catching this tender ghost. Uh-oh, a signal. Let's just hope the ghost doesn't take my tender. Oh Merlin, I think it already has. Oh no! Look up ahead! I'll get it! Oh hello again Thomas! Percy? Did you see some tenders come this way? No, not at all! But this is the only track. It must have been a... A uh, ghost! I'm sorry Merlin, the tender ghost has your tender forever. Looking for this? Wizard Funling, you got back all of the tenders. Did you see the ghost? Did I? I even battled it. I was so brave, 
I let the ghost straight in its eyes and said, leave and never come back. Wow, Wizard Funling. Everyone calls you a scaredy cat, but you must be the bravest Funling there is. Hold on a second. Detective Funling, I thought you ran away. That's exactly what I wanted you to think. But actually, I followed Wizard Funling around. And I can tell you, he didn't scare off the tender ghost. He is the tender ghost. But how did he do that? Well, when no one was looking, he takes the train's tender, then places them just close enough so you can see them, Thomas. And then, when you start approaching, he turns them into rocks and runs away. Yes, it's all true. I took all of the tenders. But why? So that I could get them all back and everyone would stop calling me a scaredy cat. We're sorry for calling you a scaredy cat, Wizard Funling. Anyway, I think that you've just proved today that deep down, everyone gets scared at some things. So Topham Hat had gone away for a few days, so it was up to Mayor Funling to give all the engines their jobs for the day. As you know, Sir Topham Hat has gone away for a few days, so I'm giving you your jobs. Now then, how do you usually decide who does what? We let the big splendid engines choose their jobs first. What? No we don't. Yes we do. Hmm, sorry Thomas, but that does make sense. We need to show off our big splendid engines by giving them the important jobs. So every engine with a tender got to choose their job first. Gordon chose to pull the express. Hero pulled some animal trucks. and Henry pulled some candy and ice cream trucks. While the small engines did the rubbish jobs, like sorting out the rubbish dump, shunting rude trucks, Ooh. Hey, Diesel. and pulling smelly fish trucks. All aboard! Hi Gordon. P you! What is that smell? It's probably us. We're filled with smelly fish. <laughs> the smell is putting off my passengers. Please keep those trucks away from me. Is everything alright, Thomas? No, all the small engines got rubbish jobs today. It's not fair. No, that doesn't sound fair. Ah, oh, I'll never get a good job because I'll always be a small engine. That's not a fair way of assigning jobs. I know, I'll use my magic to give all the small engines a good jobs tomorrow. So the next day, things were very different. Oh come on engines, why are they all late? We'll have to assign the jobs quickly today. Ah, there's Gordon. Mayor Funling, someone has taken my tender. Someone has taken my tender too. Oh, that's not good. Good morning, everyone. Thomas, you have my tender. Do I? Oh, yeah, I do. Hello, everyone. Percy, you have my tender. Look, we don't have time to sort this out now. We need to sort out who's doing what job. Now then. Thomas and Percy, you're the biggest splendid engines today, so you get first pick. Oh wow, really? Why did I wake up with this silly tender attached to me? I'm a diesel engine. Ah, but you're a big splendid engine today, Diesel. You can have first pick of the jobs too. Really? Well, uh, because I love this tender, it's fantastic. <laughs> So the usually smaller engines got all the good jobs today, like pulling the party trucks, 
pulling the special aquarium trucks. And pulling the express. While the usually large engines got the rubbish jobs, like sorting out the dump, shunting rude trucks, and pulling smelly fishy trucks. Thank you so much for this fairy fun link. These jobs are fantastic. Glad you're enjoying them, but don't forget my magic will wear off soon. Hello, Thomas. Give me back my tender. I can't. The magic has attached it to me. And besides, you smell. Please keep those smelly trucks away from me in the express. Goodbye. <laughs> oh, this isn't fair. I agree. You shouldn't get the better jobs just because you've got a tender. But the small engines aren't strong enough to pull the express. I think you'll find they are. What was that? Sounded like my magic wearing off. It wore off at the worst time for Thomas. Oh no, the express is rolling down the hill. Oh no, do something Gordon. But I'm just a small engine today. I'm not strong enough to stop the express. Yes you are. Oh fine, I'll see what I can do. I hope Fairy Funling's right. Ooh. Yes, you did it! Phew, thanks Gordon. I did do it! Huh, I guess small engines are strong enough to pull the express. Exactly, so the big engine shouldn't always get first pick at the jobs. We must be at the palace. Oh, we're back at Funlington Station. Thomas, we haven't gone anywhere. So, when deciding who does what job the next day, things were different. Why don't the smaller engines get first pick today? No, we had first pick yesterday. You choose first. Well, look at you, being so kind to each other. I can see why Sir Topham has is very proud of you all. Look what I've got. That's mine. Give it back. There's my tender. <laughs> I've got a tender. That's a my tender. OK, last off of the day, Wizard Funding's Tower. Thanks for the ride, Thomas. No problem, Rascal Funling. Hello, Thomas. Hi, Rebecca. Wow, she looks important. You only think that because she has a tender. Do you wish you had a tender, Thomas? Sometimes. One day, I'd like to be big and powerful instead of them. Anyway, I'd better be off. Bye. But that night, something strange happened. Good morning, you two. Actually, it's just me today. What? Where's Clarabelle? Thomas, Thomas, I have a problem. I woke up this morning and my tender was missing. Oh no! Hey Thomas, look what I woke up with. My own tender. That's mine. Can I use it today? I could really do with it. My tender's missing too. I've got it, Spencer. Look at me. I'm a passenger coach with a tender pulling another passenger coach. This is all very strange. Iron Addy has my tender. Ah, <laughs> look at me. I'm a diesel. I don't even need a tender. Looks good on me though. <laughs> Who's given them our tenders? Excuse me for listening, but yesterday I did hear Thomas complaining about trains with tenders. Yes, I remember that. Well, yes, but this wasn't me. Who was it then, Thomas? I don't know. I think it was Thomas. 
No, it wasn't me! Oh, everyone's blaming me for this! I've got to find out who really did this! Yay! I love having a tender! I feel so important! Detective Funling, I need your help! What? Ah, hello there, Thomas! Detective, someone took Rebecca, Spencer and Lorenzo's tenders and they're blaming me for it! Hmm, that doesn't sound like a thing you'd do! OK, Thomas, let's get to the bottom of this mystery! Who could have done this? Well, there is one train that always comes to mind whenever a prank's been committed. Aha! Gotcha, Tom Moss! <laughs> oh, he's asleep. That doesn't mean he didn't do it. Oh, Tom's been here all night. What? How do you know? I've been here looking after these flowers. And I could hear Tom snoring all night. Hmm. It wasn't Tom then. Who else could it have been? Well, I did talk to Rascal Funding about tenders yesterday. Aha! Let's talk to him then. <laughs> I do like this tender, even though it's completely pointless for me. Rascal Funling, did you take Rebecca Spencer's and Lorenzo's tenders? How could I? I'm just a Funling. I couldn't take their tenders. Hmm, he's got a point. Oh, we must be missing something. Let me think. Rebecca's tender ended up with Arthur, Spencer's went to Clarabelle, and Harry had Lorenzo's. Hmm. Oh, Detective, what's the first letter of each of their names? Well, Rebecca's is R. Arthur's is A, Spencer S, Clarabelle C, Harry A, and Lorenzo L. <gasps> that spells rascal. It was you, Rascal Fundling. Oh, <laughs> yes, it was me. Great prank, right? Why did you spell out your name like that? Oh, that wasn't my idea. It was his. <laughs> <gasps> Tom Moss. That's how you moved their tenders. You had Tom's help. <laughs> Goodbye! <laughs> well, Thomas, we got to the bottom of this mystery in the end. Yeah, thanks, Detective. Hopefully now everyone will realise that it wasn't me. The Express coming through! Billy, give it back! This is how you pull logs quickly. Hey, I've never pulled Annie and Clarabelle before. <laughs> Ferdinand was visiting Sodor from Misty Island. Hello, Thomas. <gasps> it's Ferdinand. I haven't seen him in a while. But as Thomas followed Ferdinand, he came across a bit of a problem. Hello Ferdinand! Wow, you're slow! Come on, hurry up a bit! I've got passengers to pick up! Come on! Sorry Thomas, you know me, I don't go too fast! Yeah, you can say that again! Eventually, Thomas could change to a different track. Ah, oh, finally! Hi Billy! Hi Thomas! You're a bit late! I was stuck behind Ferdinand! Really? I didn't realise he was so slow! You'd have thought that a big, powerful train with a tender like that would be faster! Oh, trains with tenders always think they're more important than us. Watch. Hello, Gordon. Excuse me, important engine coming through. See? I wish we could have tenders just for a day so we could show the big engines how to behave. Hello! Your wish is my command. Wait, what? 
What's going on? Hey, I have Ferdinand's tender. And I have Gordon's. Yes, I gave you their tenders and their jobs so you can show them how to do it properly. Uh, Thomas, my tender and truck turned into Annie and Clarabelle. You're swapping jobs for the day. Billy, give me back my tender in the express now. No, I'm going to show you how to do your job properly. Yeah, we're all swapping jobs. I get to pull Annie and Clarabelle. And I'll show Ferdinand how to pull log trucks quickly. And I'll pull the express without being rude. Oh, I don't want to work with chickens all day. See, it's easy pulling these logs quickly. Phew, they are heavy though. Look at me, I'm so much faster without my heavy tender. Whoops. Oh, oh, phew. Come on Thomas, speed up, you're slowing me down. I'm going as quickly as I can, Ferdinand. Come on, come on. I've got passengers to pick up. Oh, 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 hold on. I'm not doing this job any faster than you. See, it's not as easy as it looks. No, I'm sorry for complaining about you earlier. That's okay, Thomas. We Express coming through! Come on, chickens! Please hop onto the truck! No! Oh. No, oh, here comes Billy! Hi, Billy! Express coming through! Hey! He ignored me! Just like I usually ignore him! <gasps> Wait a second! I ignored Gordon! I'm sorry Gordon, I said I'd pull the express without being rude, but then I was just rude to you. That's okay Billy, I'm sorry for being rude to you too. Thanks Gordon, oh, I don't really want this tender anymore. Me neither, we'd like to swap back too. Yeah, I want to go back to my old job. So all of you want to swap back? I hope you've all learned a valuable lesson about each other. Yes, we have. Definitely. Absolutely. Oh, yes. Oh, good. Ah, oh, that's better. Everything's back to normal. Yes, and I'll never complain about not having a tender ever again.